It is an honor to welcome this year's recipient of the Arthur Ashe Award for Courage, Maya Moore. Power is not meant to be gripped with a clenched fist or to be hoarded, but power is meant to be handled generously so we can thoughtfully empower one another to thrive in our communities for love's sake. A lot of people are still talking about that inspiring moment from the ESPYs on Saturday. Yes, we have shared how Maya Moore stepped away at the peak of her pro basketball career to help get wrongfully convicted Jonathan Irons released after 23 years in prison. Now Jonathan and Maya are married and they're fighting for justice for others. Their story is a subject of the new ESPN 30 for 30 documentary, Breakaway, directed by Emmy Award winning Rudy Valdez and produced by my company, Rock and Robin Productions. Maya, Jonathan, Rudy are all joining us live and it is great to see all of you together. I'm excited people are going to be able to see the documentary tonight. Maya, you are, you're normally a private person. Tell everybody why you felt it was so important to open your heart, open your home to share this journey, Maya. Yeah, Robin, I think this story um, is so, it's so powerful. I think it's such a, a human story. And part of my desire to, to share was I really feel like people can find themselves in this story, whether they're connecting with Jonathan's struggle or his fight, or if you're a, also an athlete like I am, or just relating to my family members who are just extraordinary, ordinary, everyday people. Um, you can find yourself in this story and I hope it can really encourage people uh, from all walks of life. I truly believe it's gonna resonate with a lot of different people. Jonathan, okay, released from prison after two decades. Marriage, can you, can you just begin to share the emotions that you have felt this past year? Um, it's more of, it's more like, it's like being awakened or, or, or being reborn or coming back to life again after just almost living in a, in a, 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 a frozen land that's, that's kind of hard and, and, and cold and emotionless mm. because of the environment. You have to constantly be on a swivel and being aware in prison to coming out in society and just being embraced with love and, and, and goodness and it's just people just embracing me and wanting to wanting to encourage me and, and check on me and it, that, that matters man I, 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 I want that for uh, other other prisoners that, that come out of come out of prison and people that are wrongfully convicted uh, because there's a fear in prison that people are not going to accept you or, or, or want you around because because of the fact that you've been in prison there's a natural stigma yeah. there and and I just I haven't felt that, and I'm so grateful for that, and I'm I'm so grateful grateful to be married to to Maya. She's she's been instrumental in my transition and just helping me understand the world and society and just uh, the station that that I have in life. And and, and I, I need I need her, and uh, and she needs me, and we're we're doing it. We're, yeah. we're living life. You're a dynamic <laughs> duo. It was so good to both see you both on Saturday. You know, one of the reasons, of course, why so many are familiar with this story is because of Maya taking that leap of faith, putting her basketball career on hold to fight for you, Jonathan. Let's take a look at a clip from Breakaway. When Maya made the decision to step away from the game, I felt conflicted. Like, I don't, I don't want to be the reason for that. And, you know, she explained to me, it's like, like, it's not just about that. I want to prioritize some other things and it's centered around family and ministry which I, th I see as one thing that's that's my first ministry is my family and wanting to be more present for that and really is and rudy rudy a emmy award-winning director yes i know i know that johnson's story <laughs> really hits close to home for you your emmy winning documentary the sentence is about your family's fight to free your sister from prison what was it like to go through it all again with jonathan rudy 
Uh, thank you. Uh, hi, Jonathan. Hi, Maya. Good to see you. <laughs> uh, yeah, my, my film, The Sentence, is uh, the reason why I'm a filmmaker. You know, it, it's the foundation of who I am as a storyteller, and I quickly realized that the, the story of my sister and the headlines that were going on around not only her but other people like her, uh, I wanted to go around that and tell a very personal human story about what it means to incarcerate somebody for an extended amount of time and, and what that does to the community and families left behind. You know, taking all, everything that I learned from that and bringing it to Maya and Jonathan's, Jonathan's story, you know, immediately I wanted to get past the headline. I, I, I fully, you know, not to um, sidestep how wonderful uh, basketball player and legendary basketball player Maya is, I knew that there was something around the corner of that headline. And at its core, this film is about a human being believing in another human being. Mm -hmm. And then you go past that and you find, you know, this agency, this, this, these two people, these, this family, that are heroes in their own story, and I wanted to tell that version of the story because I think that the hearts and minds are what's going to help change these laws and help change people's perspective on incarceration and people who are incarcerated and families of yeah. people who are incarcerated. So I, I feel very fortunate to have been able to tell this story. And we are very fortunate that you were available to help tell the story and you have really made a difference. And uh, finally, my, I loved how you said this about making an impact. You know, a lot of us want to do that, and we think it has to be far and wide. That's how you put it. But you said it's about going narrow and deep with one person, as you and your family did with Jonathan. What do you both hope people will take away from seeing your story tonight, Maya and Jonathan? Absolutely, <clears throat> absolutely, Robin. That's such a revelation for me, I feel like, in the last few years of understanding the way that we can have impact is not just about being the biggest, mm -hmm. the farthest, the widest, the loudest, but it's really about everyone in their sphere of influence figuring out a way to go narrow and deep and trying to model and show people the richness, the, the life. Um, I feel like a lot of us are searching for purpose and for meaning and for reasons to get up. And sometimes they're not as far as you think. Mm -hmm. Sometimes they're right around you. And it's just about continuing day by day, being faithful to pouring out what you can to those people around you. And you'll realize you'll find your life in those narrow and deep ways. And so I'm just mm. excited to see the impact, um, which will eventually end up going far and wide when, when people all over end up trying to do that, that narrow and deep. And I'm, I'm just inviting people to, to figure out what that looks like in their own sphere, and, and we're, we're excited to show people what that looked like for us. That's beautiful. Both of you, thank you so much. And Rudy, cannot thank you um, for helping share this incredible story. Mm -hmm. All right. Thank you, Robin. I almost didn't recognize you without the tux on, Jonathan, because you were looking really, you were looking good in your tux on Saturday. Thank he you. did. Thank you. Very it's handsome. Oh, well. oh, oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> thank you. All right. Thank you all so, so very, very much. And I hope that you will tune in tonight because Break Breakaway airs tonight at 9 p.m. Eastern on ESPN, a 30 for 30 documentary. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.